Hello, everybody. This is JVB from TalkingAboutGames.com and the Post Game Report podcast. Here is the first and hopefully many uh, game nights with the Post Game Report. And here we decided to play Gears of War 3, do some horde mode on one of the new maps that were from the booster pack or pack. I still have a cold, so excuse me about that. I do apologize in advance if you hear any boogery noises coming from my nose. I haven't played Gears, Gears of War 3 in quite some time, and so I forgot that I have to pay for some of these weapons. And though you start off with $1,000, I decided to save that money, kill the first few waves of enemies, and gain some money. But then, through throughout the first minute or so of the game, the guys tell me that we're playing on insane, so that strategy is a turn for the worst. As you can see, I'm trying to chainsaw that freaking nub. And I was dealing with some lag. And I thought I was going to get me a kill here, but somebody shot him before I could. So the lag was pretty bad. As you can tell by my whopping zero, I really contributed immensely. I was actually a decoy, so these guys should thank me for doing that. Alright, so... And mind you, these particular videos, they're not in order, so this, this is not round to round. I just took selective video. Now, I, I figured I'd play nice and I upgrade that particular fence, which made me broke. Couldn't even get grenades, as you can see. And now I'm sprinting, and I'm sprinting so fast that I'm on fire. And here come some locusts. So I run really fast because, as you can see, it's on insane, and I'm, I'm, I was going to die. I was scared. Now on horde mode, I, I, I like to play a support role. I like to use a sniper rifle. Unfortunately, because I haven't played in so long, I was ineffective. And you'll witness that right now. The boomer almost got me. Here I'm dealing with lag. It took me too long to actually do an active reload. So this guy figured I would shoot him on, on shoot him on the tank where he would blow up. Once again, I forgot it was on insane. And that was a futile attempt at doing anything. All right, here I'm assuming that I'm going to shoot a, an enemy that I thought was there, but he wasn't. And two of my compadres, they fall, and it took me forever to get them up because of the lag. And here you'll see my character jumping up and down, acting all silly. See him? He's twitching. I'm stuck in a corner, doing the moonwalk. And I think around here, the, the round ends. Yes, I'm about to throw a smoke grenade. And instead I throw it on my foot. Alright, once again I'm on fire. And that's a modifier that Soldier X, he unlocked. Because he's like a level 100 or something. <laughs> I think he even surpassed that. I think just for Gears of War 3, they let him prestige like four times. Alright, so, I forgot to mention that in this particular game I'm playing with Heroic Superman, who is on the turret, and, and pay attention to that, <laughs> TG1 Eddie, Nemesis Prime, and Soldier X. As you are fully aware, I am the biggest contributor in the money department on Horde Mode, which is total sarcasm. As you can see, I can't shoot shit. Alright, and Marcus Phoenix without the do-rag and the alpha, he looks like Mark Sanchez. Alright, so I'm on fire once again. Not literally. Well, literally, in the game. But not where it counts. Not on fire and shooting enemies. As you can see, I didn't shoot anybody in that particular sequence. Now here comes the part 
that is really crucial, especially in horde mode. There are people that are down, they're in need of help. You go and you rescue them. Well, before I leave, I want to remind you, you can find me at TalkingAboutGames.com in the Post Game Report Podcast. And here is the big event, where Heroic Superman leaves me to die. Look at him, sitting on the fucking turret, paying no mind to the fact that I'm dead, or dying. And look at him, look at him, watch, watch. He's all happy, he thinks he's gonna save the day on his little turret, and he dies. So long everybody.